Hey guys, um, today I'm going to show you how to make a registration site for your private server. Okay, let's get started by downloading the website. I'll put the link in the description below. And yeah, this is the website. Just click download and it should start. And in order to um, open this, you're going to want to go to Google and download WinRAR. If you don't have that, go ahead and download that. Should be the first one. Okay, now open the 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 zip file and extract the PACW folder into your desktop. And now you're gonna want to open up your um, computer, open up your repack folder, and if you don't have the server folder which is a server folder like this which has MySQL, Apache and then the htdocs folder if you don't have this folder then you're gonna want to download exam you could go ahead and google that just spell it x a m p p download that and download the Apache service okay um, well now just open up your htdocs folder delete anything in there open up the PACW folder select everything and drag it into your HC docs folder okay now we're gonna wanna go to core and config to find this info right here database connection you're gonna wanna go to your repack folder your archimu folder your configs folder open up logon.config with notepad and where it says logon database hostname this is the info that you'll need so for hostname is localhost username root password ascent so I'm just gonna go ahead and put that localhost root password ascent for DB accounts and DB characters you're going to want to open up your database for that so in order to do that open up MySQL get any um, database editing program like KDSQL or Navica Lite and connect if you don't know how to connect just go to your logon config file and where it says logon database um, that's your info that you need to connect okay um, now you see these tables right here character is where my characters table is at right here so in the character database so for where it says DBA characters I'm gonna put character and where my accounts are at they're in the logon database you see my accounts table um, so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go ahead and put logon for where it says accounts now just scroll down a little bit where it says stats dot xml um, this is really for Archimu users um, your stats dot xml file is um, located in your Archimu folder and see mine is right here just copy the where it's located so up here and just paste it on here make sure not to delete anything and right here it tells you um, put one if you want to display uptime and online GM's two for display only uptime three for displays only online GM's and zero for um, this it disables everything for website settings um, I would recommend um, just putting the the multiple multi IP to zero so only one, one person per IP could register max players if you have a big server just change the max players to a thousand or ten thousand if you don't just leave it like two hundred or one hundred and how to connect it tells you right here it's pretty self-explanatory you um, feel free to change any of the steps right here but make sure not to delete these quotes right here 
just edit the text only and right here with these romless put your romless right here and that's pretty much it just exit and save now if you want to take a look look at your website you can go to mysql open up apache 2 now for now it's at localhost so just go to localhost type in localhost in this so it says I have already used an IP to register an account if you don't want this to show up where it says um, multiple IPs just change that back to one so it, this won't happen status see tells you the online GMs, the uptime, the players how to connect here's the steps and yeah in order for the website to go to your like say your Hamachi IP or your um, or your DNS host name you're gonna wanna go to your Apache folder open up the CONF folder which is conf open up the HTTPD file open it with notepad open it and scroll down a little bit where it says server name it's right below server admin change localhost either to your Hamachi IP or your host name and remember if you have Hamachi make sure that your the ones that are trying to get into your website are in your Hamachi network and just exit out and save so yeah that's pretty much it and that's all you have to do to set up this website um, I hope the tutorial was e easy to follow and again I want to give credits to um, ping of pingcms.com I mean the ping.com and the creator of pingcms I'll be putting a link to his website in the description and everything that you found in this video I'll also be putting a link to to it in the description um, thanks for watching remember to comment rate and subscribe and Bye.